Welcome back to Robin's Kitchen. Hey y'all, let me tell you what just happened. <laughs> I made these beautiful cupcakes. I put the mix together and guess what? I didn't film any of it. I thought I hit start and I guess I didn't. So then I realized, oh my God, <laughs> what's going on? But you know what? All is not lost. I love you guys so much. We're going to keep pushing. Things happen. We make mistakes, but it's how we overcome those mistakes. So this is a lesson for all of us. All is not lost because we still got to make the buttercream frosting. We still got to put our little embellishments on it. So it's going to be beautiful. And we have a major announcement at the end of this video. So I'm still excited. You guys voted and we are making eggnog cupcakes. So let me tell you what I did, what I thought I recorded. <laughs> I have one box of your standard cake mix. You can use vanilla or yellow, whatever you decide, whatever brand. I don't have a, a particular brand in mind. Whatever is on sale works. We're gonna use three large eggs. We're gonna have one cup of full fat egg nog, one cup, one stick of melted butter, unsalted butter, we're gonna have a half a teaspoon of rum extract and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. We're gonna have, of course, our cake mix, and then we're gonna add a half a teaspoon of nutmeg and one teaspoon of cinnamon. What I did, this is still beautiful, what I did first was I put all the wet ingredients. So I put the eggs, I, I let those beat for about a minute, then I added the eggnog, and then I streamed in the butter. I streamed it in like, woo! So we have the butter. And then I added my extract. So I let that mix for about two minutes. Then I added the cake mix. I slowly added it, had it on low. We don't want to over mix. That's what we don't want to do. Then I added my cinnamon and my nutmeg. And everything was like, it was moving and grooving. And I'm like, woo! And I'm talking and I'm telling you guys how the cake mix ain't the same weight like it used to be. And now only makes 23 cupcakes and all this stuff, right? <laughs> I also told everybody to preheat their oven to 350 degrees. We're gonna allow these beautiful cupcakes. Look how beautiful though. It is beautiful. We're gonna allow these beautiful cupcakes to bake around 15 to 20 minutes. We're gonna stick our toothpick in. We're gonna make sure we have crumbs on the toothpick because we want a moist cake. When we come back, we're gonna make our beautiful buttercream frosting, which is gonna have all the beautiful spices. We're gonna have a little nutmeg in there, cinnamon, ginger. We're gonna use some of the eggnog. It's gonna be delightful. We're gonna add a few embellishments. And at the end of this video, I have a special announcement. So I'll see you guys in Hey y'all, I had to make sure my camera was recording. <laughs> Because, Lord, I ain't doing this again. Okay, so you see that I changed my uh, attachment to a whip attachment. So we're going to use this for the buttercream. If you don't have a stand mixer, that is fine. You can always use your hand mixer, you know. Use what you got, right? But I'm going to put two sticks of unsalted butter. Oh, Lord. Two sticks. We want to make sure they're room temperature. They're firm, but they have a little give right so we want to make sure it's room temperature we are going to let these like fluff up i'm gonna cream this butter for about mm, let's say about five minutes we're gonna start this on low and then i'm gonna cream it for about five minutes and then we're gonna slowly add our powdered sugar and i have we're not gonna use this much eggnog but you know i just want you guys to see what it is and i have my spices here i have a quarter teaspoon of ground ginger, a quarter teaspoon of nutmeg, and a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. And we're also gonna add vanilla to this mix. So we're gonna let this cream for about five minutes. We're gonna come back and we're gonna slowly add our powdered sugar and our, uh, what is this, eggnog. So see you in five minutes. Hey, you guys. So our butter has been creaming for about five minutes. Look how silky and luxurious this looks. It is like um, white, it changed color. Like it was already a, a light colored butter, but 
when you whip it for about five minutes, it will like, it's gonna turn completely white. So look how silky that is, right? So I'm gonna lock this down because you know I'll be having mishaps, baby. We're going to slowly add, this is a cup, I love this, a cup, oh, I'll put on low, of powdered sugar. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. I'm also gonna add my spices here at this point, at the beginning. So all my spices, a quarter teaspoon of ginger, a half a teaspoon of nutmeg, and a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. I'm gonna slowly add a little bit of eggnog. We're gonna alternate. Oh, the color is beautiful, guys. This color is gorgeous. I'm gonna show you while still mixing. And make sure you scrape the sides of your bowl. But look at the color of this. This is delightful, it's divine. We're going to continue to do this. And let me scrape the sides of the bowl because that is important. Make sure we get everything mixed in there, you know. Mmm, all the spices, the, the, the eggnog, oh my gosh. It is so beautiful, it's so beautiful. So we're gonna let this, we're gonna do about three and a half cups of powdered sugar. Some more powdered sugar. We're gonna add, put it on low. We don't want it. Come on, I'm gonna add a little bit of vanilla. Whoa, my vanilla. <laughs> oh, a little bit of vanilla. I'm not gonna add the rum extract to this. Um, cause it's already in cake. Add a little bit of the egg roll. Yes. Mm. And we're gonna continue to alternate until we have like, this is gonna be about three cups, three to four cups of buttercream. We're gonna pipe this, we're gonna put this in a piping bag and pipe our cupcakes. If you do not have a piping bag, that's fine because you can use a knife, whatever you have at the house. So when we come back, we are going to nicely decorate our cupcakes. See you guys. It is time to ice our cupcakes. I already started. You see I have some in the back back here. That's about a dozen. <laughs> I can't believe this happened. <laughs> Again, my video cut off. But we ice these cupcakes. We use the piping bag. But like I said, if you do not have a piping bag, you can use like a butter knife, you can use the ice cream scoop, whatever you want. But we piped the icing on there and we added a little bit of embellishment. So I added walnuts to the top of these. I used the walnuts here and then I drizzled, I melted some cookie butter. I melted it for about 25 seconds and then I just drizzled a little bit on top of these cupcakes for a little razzle dazzle. If you have a nut allergy, you don't have to do the nuts. You can just do the cookie butter. If you don't like cookie butter, I have plain ones in the back here. So, okay, I don't know what's up with this video, but I feel like it's gonna be a great video. <laughs> but like I said at the beginning of the video, I have a major announcement. We are on the road to a thousand. We are the little engine that could Robin's Kitchen. I am a one woman team. <laughs> one day. We are gonna be, we're gonna be a big team. I'm already speaking that. But until then, let me tell you what we're gonna do. We're at the cusp of a thousand subscribers. Once we hit a thousand subscribers, I'm gonna have a giveaway. I'm gonna give away a $75 Amazon gift card. So we're gonna have a big episode. We're gonna have a party. We're just gonna have a good old time. We're gonna have a giveaway. And then once we hit that thousand, we're gonna be on the road to 10,000. And once we hit 10,000 subscribers, we're gonna have a like a major giveaway. Once we get to 10,000 subscribers, I'm gonna give first prize is gonna be a KitchenAid mixer. Second prize is gonna be a KitchenAid food processor. And third prize is gonna be a baking set with the baking sheets, muffin tins, cake pans, all of that. You're gonna get a beautiful baking set once we get to 10,000. And I believe it's gonna happen soon. But we're on the road to 1,000, we're at the cusp. So I need you guys to invite your friends and family, tell them to subscribe, because one of you guys will be the lucky winners of the Amazon gift card and you can use it for whatever you want. 
This episode was all over the place, y'all. You see, my camera was cutting off. I said, well, what's going on? But you know what? We're going to still keep pushing. We are the little engine that could. And until next time, don't be afraid to take a risk. I love you guys. Merry Christmas. <laughs> See you. <laughs> don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.